Yes. I came yes. to bring the pain hardcore to your brain. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome back to another episode of Blurred Up Reacts, where we watch and react to the latest and greatest in movie, TV, and gaming. Of course, we are your hosts. I'm Killa Cam. And I'm Monique. And today we'll be reacting to the very brand new trailer, Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings. Finally! I was wondering when they was going to put this trailer out. <laughs> like, it went like a long time without putting this trailer. I think they were trying to figure out like how COVID was going to do this yeah. year anything out so yeah because even when i was just trying to like look up for stuff maybe i want to say maybe it was around last year i could only find like concept art there was like no mm -hmm. pictures and i was like well is it happening <laughs> <laughs> and, then, and then i kept seeing it pop up on the marvel list of what's next to be released mm -hmm. and i was like but is it though because i haven't <laughs> seen nothing <laughs> yeah you realize this is five months away yeah. Usually Disney be having their trailers out like a year. Right. At least <laughs> something yeah. out. Yeah. yeah. So I was getting a little worried for a second there. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I, I think Feige and the MCU, they're a little bit more stable than DC. So when they say something's going to come out, it may not happen immediately, but they're working yeah. on it. They're finding a way to work on it. So I That's can trust that. that with them. Um, here's the thing for, for once with one of these movies though, I'm kind of in the dark. I don't remember any Shang-Chi from the comics I read and we read a lot of comics as a kid, but I just don't remember this character so much. So, yeah, I think it's that we just didn't gravitate more towards the, uh, Shang-Chi character and yeah. that's fine. You know, not everybody likes every book, every comic book character, but I am glad that this is the first kind of Asian superhero movie that is out there. So yeah. um, I'm glad we're getting it. I just, yeah, for war warning you guys, I don't know a lot about Shang-Chi. I know that probably the most that I know is that um, the Mandarin, which not, not the Trevor Mandarin from mm -hmm. Iron Man 3, but the Mandarin is supposed to make an appearance appearance in, in this movie. Um, and he's going to be the real Mandarin. I don't know. <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't have a lot of knowledge about Shang Chi. Yeah. That's that's on me. But here's the thing, though, y'all y'all can't fault us because we were kids, and when you have allowance, you've got a certain amount of money that you can spend <laughs> on comics, so you have to make that shit stretch. So. Yeah. I really gravitated towards those Ninja Turtle comics. So, <laughs> like, those are my jam. Yeah. <laughs> So, I mean, like, I'm excited to jump into this. Before we do, thank you to everyone who has been liking and subscribing to our channel. Of course, the likes, the views, the shout outs, the comments, the shares, all of that is truly what helps us grow. So from the bottom of our hearts to you, we say thank you. And of course, if you are new, just dropping by our channel. Hi, nice to see you. <laughs> if you're digging the content. <laughs> exactly you know if you're digging the content make sure you hit the like button it truly does help us and if you want to stay up to date with all of our reviews and reactions make sure you hit the subscribe button we'd love to have you in the family yep <laughs> hi <laughs> <laughs> all right let's jump into this the trailer for shang chi and the legend of the ten rings you ready i'm ready let's go all right Oh. You've been punching it? Yep. I know, right? Okay. I get we get it. You can do push-ups. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I remember those days. <laughs> <laughs> and where did that get you? Oh. Oh, wow. In my shadow. I trained you. The most the most dangerous people in the world couldn't kill you. Son. It's time for you to take your place by my side. Mm, okay. Ooh, oh, 
Maybe. <laughs> Oh, uh -huh. got saber tooth stuff. I don't know if that's saber tooth. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, they are you? Shame sheep. Whoa. Oh, Oh, shit. <laughs> so supposed to be like speed? That's what I was getting ready to say. That we made a good team! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love Aquafina. Oh, hell awesome. yeah. I, I'm lift, uh, look, I will type for yeah. that. Look, the only thing was missing was the Wu-Tang Clan. That was the only thing that was missing. Ooh, yes. <laughs> I can't yes. bring the pain go to your brain. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that was pretty awesome. So it sounds like from the voiceover that like he was supposed to. I always get this. I always get this saying wrong, and it's for it's because of coming to America. <laughs> so his royal, his royal oats. oats. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? Uh, yeah. Well, <laughs> I don't know if it's exactly that, but like, because he was like, I gave you ten years. To do uh -huh. whatever you want to do live a normal life and now it's time for you to come take your place okay, and i'm I guessing that's the mandarin talking like it's time for you to take your place at you know with me at my side um, yeah so or even take over um but yeah i'm i probably should look at the definitions and <laughs> definition of so, so well that means out. going out and fucking a bunch of people that's what that means no, no. <laughs> Wow, that's what I was like, what? Real R. <laughs> that's what I was like, what? <laughs> that's what he yeah. was supposed to be doing. <laughs> I need to read the dictionary more. Um. <laughs> that looked lit. Now, listen, you know, I'm all about the fight scenes, you know, especially mm -hmm. the aesthetic that they've got going on here. Like, it's pleasing to my eye. So the story could be yeah. beautiful, and I'm still going to watch it because it reminds me of those old school, excuse me those old school Saturday morning Kung Fu flicks I used to watch with daddy. Yeah. So yeah. I, yeah. I, I'm going to watch that. Yeah. A uh, shout out to the um, guy who does play Shang-Chi, uh, Simi, Simu Lu. Mm -hmm. If I said his name wrong, y'all, I'm sorry, but I did want to shout out him because uh, doing a great shop job so far from what I've seen from this trailer. Also, it's his birthday. Happy birthday. Oh, it's his birthday. <laughs> yeah, I was. I saw that when I was looking up <laughs> info for this. So, yes, it is his birthday. That's a so wonderful birthday, birthday present. Look, yeah, <laughs> your trailer yeah. come out, your Marvel trailer come out. Look, <laughs> this is the bragging also, rights. Like, I, I know. Uh, yeah, little actors and shit. Like... <laughs> <laughs> fucking birthday got this marvel i'm in the mcu man <laughs> yeah. holla at me yeah. man <laughs> um i want to highlight though one villain that i saw in there and it's uh -huh. he's played by florian i'm gonna mess up this last name montaigne montanu montanu but uh -huh. he was basically um in creed 2 uh he was um Lord, I didn't forgot these people's names. He was <laughs> <laughs> he was the son of Ivan Dra Drago. Uh huh. Um. So he's actually playing a villain named Razor Fist in this movie, which it I think I'm familiar with Razor Fist just a little bit, but not a lot. Like he, he I think he either cuts off one hand or both hands and replace them with like little sword thingies. Uh huh. So that's why you saw in the trailer where he was like, he had the doing did he some, have the, yeah. the bands on his wrist? Was that the guy that had kind of like the no? Blue rings on he his was wrist? the he was the guy on the bus who was doing the whole sword action. Okay, like yeah, um, you'll probably go have to go back to look. I know that kind of went by fast, but I did notice that in there. Um, oh, I, I know who you're. Yeah, for I know mm -hmm. exactly who you're talking about. He played Victor Drago in Creed. Two. Yes, he played Victor. Yeah. Yes. Um. Yeah, so I uh, also, oh, hold on, I didn't forget. Michelle Yao Michelle is also Yow. in this movie. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. And um, yo, crazy thing, I actually went to go look at her <laughs> filmography, and the first thing that pops up is Avatar 4 and 5. And I'm like, yo, we haven't even got Avatar 2 yet. Like, mm -hmm. I forgot they were 
filming those movies back to back but we know her from uh, of course crouching tiger hidden dragon yeah. and she was also in crazy rich Re- asians most recently so yeah. i'm excited to see her in this movie as well you you know what um that's a, the thing about this movie because she's also in the, 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 the sorry i got distracted by something i just saw but um what i like about this movie is is it's it's all asian you know (laughs) it's all asian and i think that's super important when you're telling these type of stories not to again cast james remar as raiden but um (laughs) (laughs) you know what i mean actually i think florian uh, might be the only person in here who is not asian because i don't think he's asian but yeah still pretty cool that you know, I, I know we got Crazy Rich Asians not too long ago, and yeah. that was a big, big hit with everybody. But this is more of like the action type Marvel type movie. Yeah. So, yeah, it's it's I, I'm loving everything uh, about just like we did with Black Panther. I'm exactly. loving that they had this, that all Asian cast, pretty much all Asian cast. Yeah. He- <laughs> and, and that's exactly the point I was about to say that Marvel does a really good job about creating the cinematic universe and keeping the pockets of stories true to whatever the geographic is you know Mm -hmm, so mm -hmm. i i I appreciate that i'm also appreciating this one because what it does look like they've done is specifically with the ogs like michelle yo because remember she started off in asian cinema and transitioned into u.s cinema i like seeing Mm -hmm. those old school people from those old subtitle movies I used to watch mm-hmm. just because the action was off the chain to see them transition into U.S. Uh, movies and now seeing her transition into a freaking Marvel movie, though she was in Guardians of the Galaxy. But yeah. this is different. This is like, when we watch this, I'm going to be like, yeah, it makes me actually want to go back and watch um, Crouching Tiger, Hidden Dragon a yeah, little bit. Yeah, definitely. I haven't watched so. that in a while, but yeah. Cool. Well, man, look, listen, again, like we said, we don't know much about this story, but from what we saw, we're digging it. And this has actually prompted me like now I got to go back and do some research and see what this (laughs) is all about. So that's what I'm going to do. But what do you guys think about this trailer? Are you excited to see this entry into the MCU? Drop down in the comments and let us know. Until next time, we are your hosts. I'm Killer Cam. And I'm Monique. We'll see you on the next episode of Blurred Up Reacts. Thanks, guys.